Whoa, hey internet, it's cassette. Uh, fun, fun, intro, intro, whatever, music, go. Okay, that's fun. Okay, so Minecraft video. Um, 1.9, as you can see in the upper left-hand corner. Uh, 1.9 has been released three times so far. So now we're up to uh, 1.9.3. Um, <clears throat> with this current update has come item enchanting, potions, um, and just a bunch of other stuff. I think uh, animal breeding as well. But uh, for the sake of this video, I'm only going to focus on one thing, and that's item enchantment. So let's uh, let's take a dip and take a look. Ooh. That's fun. That is fantastic. Uh, that was fun. So I lost all my experience points, and that's really what you use to uh, enchant items on Minecraft. So I'm going to do it anyway. I'm going to do it live. Uh, this is about three hours of pig slaying gone to uh, waste. Not three hours, maybe 30 minutes. So here we go. An, encraf an encrafting. Uh, an enchanting table. Pretty neat. Pretty neat. It follows you and does little flips. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So um, the different items that me I'll tab for a second. Uh, the different items that you can enchant with it are uh, your helmet, chest plate, leggings, boots, swords, pickaxe, axe, shovel, hoe, shear, fishing rod, flint and steel, and for some reason, apparently, you can enchant raw chicken. Nope. You can't enchant raw chicken. This site is incorrect, but I know for a fact you can enchant all the other stuff. So, um, essentially the way it works is it takes uh, the amount of experience points you have at the bottom, if you can see that, it's actually got a number and the jumping glitch has been fixed. See, it's not bouncing around anymore, although I am bouncing around, so anyway. Um, so it, what it does is you drag in your item, and these numbers right here are how much the enchantment costs. I can't afford any of these because I'm at one. I was at six, now I'm at one. So. Um, I'm not quite sure how it works, and neither is most of the internet, uh, just because essentially you get random levels, I guess, for just dragging them in. Ran I, you know, it's weird. Like, if, if you can see, I'm getting random levels, now I've got level one. Essentially, uh, it improves the function of each item. So, right here, you can see I've got enchanted boots. If you saw uh, before I killed myself by you know, diving into the water. Uh, I had an enchanted pickaxe, and that actually uh, breaks through walls quicker, which is neat. So, um, let's see, and, and enchanted boots, you can sprint faster, takes less food or some, I don't know, shit. So I'm just gonna keep dragging this in until I get a level one enchant. Um, believe it or not, actually, all these hieroglyphics uh, mean something. They're actually uh, a uh, language I don't know off the top of my head, but they're all, here we go, they're all translated on the internet, and I'll, I might link it in the description, but whatever. Um, but for the sake of time, let's enchant my sword with uh, this, and there you go. Easy as one, two, three. And then it glows blue and it says enchanted. Um, you can see the enchant on it right there is 607. It, uh, it, like I said, the what's been uh, sort of discovered so far about the enchantments is um, they improve the function of the item. Um, people are reporting uh, that if you go high enough, like the 15s, the 10s, whatever, the 9s, they actually do things like light people or light mobs on fire and and so on and so forth. That you know, just they did have different effects. So I'd encourage you to go out and try it yourself. Um, if you can notice at the bottom of my screen, uh, where there was now one, there was zero because the enchant took that experience or the points or whatever it's called. So um, so yeah, that's enchantments. It's actually really neat. Uh, let me put this on. Changes the color of your items and. Uh, adds effects. So 
super neat adds a whole new sort of layer to minecraft although i will say it is a bit disappointing that the only way you can earn experience or points or whatever you want to call it at this point is by killing things um it would be nice to see you get experience from say gardening or or doing something uh less passive just because i know a lot of times i don't want to go on minecraft and have to go you know raiding the nether or uh crusading out at dark you know but you know so far right now the only way to gather experience or points is just by um slaying things essentially so if you have um if you have a, a mod like this one right here you can just spawn in uh pig spawners and just kill those over and over and over and over and over and over and over again which is what i did um or you can just go out at night and uh kill endermen so Anyway, so that's the video. Um, I'll have more up later going over the um, potions aspect and the animal breeding and whatever and all the new stuff in 1.9.3. But yeah, so thanks for watching. Um, see you guys later.